Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how to upload photos and videos to Twitter and YouTube directly from the N900's gallery and camera application. You'll need to go to the OVIST office and download Bifrog Photo and Video Upload, as well as YouTube Video Uploader. You can install others, but those are my favourite too for uploading media online directly from the N900. Once installed, without ever having to go to the web browser, you can now upload photos and videos to Twitter and YouTube from the gallery application or from the camera application. It's as easy as selecting the photo and clicking share. Before you can do this though you have to add new account. These are the accounts I've already validated. Click new and then add a new account. You'll need to have a pixel pipe account first but you can make things easier by registering through your Twitter account if you have one. It'll open up a pixel pipe web page. Just follow those instructions, go back to the gallery or camera application and validate the account. Once validated you can then use the upload services. It is Yfrog or just change the title, set it to test, and then click share. And that's it. It'll process and then upload and you can do whatever in the background. You'll notice that little green share icon, and if you click on the status you'll see it says sharing. It'll stay there until your media has uploaded. So just to show you again, it's as simple as clicking the share icon, and then share via service and then clicking share. You can of course as you've seen change the title, change the description and even add tags. As well as doing this from the gallery application you can do this from the camera app. Just open that up, take a quick picture, Just get this N85 I won't upload this but I'll just show you the the share icons there, just click that, share via service and same thing again, you've got the same options, quickly just upload a photo as soon as you've taken it. So the first photo that I was uploading has already uploaded, as you can see the sharing sign has gone. If you go straight to Twitter, I'll skip out some loading bits because there's something wrong with my Wi-Fi. So here's Twitter, and here's my tweet directly from the N900's gallery got the description that I've written as well as a link to the Yfrog picture. Although it's uploaded the full size picture, it shouldn't normally take this long. The reason it's taking this long is because my Virgin Media internet is broken again, I think. We'll ignore that for now and just show you how to upload a picture again. Just select the photo, share via service, and then change the title. This will be your message to maybe describe the picture. You can also use hashtags and at codes. Once you're done with the description, just click share. It'll upload in the background and you can continue to do other tasks. So here's the sharing indicator, and there it's disappeared as it's finished uploading that picture. And it's published immediately to Twitter. You just open up Twitter web page. It's loading up a little bit faster now. And you can see there's a new tweet that's different to the other one, as it's got those hashtags and at tags. We'll open up that page. So this is what 20 megabits per second is supposed to get you on Virgin Media. As you can see, it's rather slow. What I can show you though is how you can quickly switch to a different connection. Here I'll switch to my T-Mobile 3G connection. Just click on the status bar, change connection, and then I'll just select T-Mobile Internet. Now I'm using T-Mobile. We'll just refresh the page, or I'll just open up that link again from the Twitter, Twitter page. And you'll see it should load much quicker than my wireless. Excuse the blurriness, my camera is trying to autofocus. So there you can see it's already loading quicker using 3G than my wireless. Now I'll show you uploading to YouTube. You can do this directly from the video gallery or you can do this from the camera app. Here I'll show you from the camera app. 
Let me just start recording this video. Just a few seconds. And then finish. Recording. Once that's processed, all you need to do is hit the share button again. Share via service. You can also upload video using Whitefrog, but this time I'll use YouTube. It's the same process again, you'll need to have a pixel pipe account. You can use the same pixel pipe account and as you've seen it's pretty straightforward just following the instructions and then validating that account. So just change the title here. Set some tags. If these are previously used tags, you can make new ones. You can also set the uh, video description. Testing on N900. Then once that's done, just click share. Same process as before, you'll get the green share icon and you can see it if you click on the status that it's still sharing. Once it's finished uploading, that notification disappears. You now head over to YouTube to see if that's been uploaded. By the way, this is all still on my T-Mobile internet and not via my home wireless. So here's my YouTube profile. As you can see, the video has uploaded. I'll just zoom up on it. Put a circle zoom. And there's the video. Test upload on N900. Check on that. Go to the main player screen, zoom out. And here's the video. This was recorded and uploaded straight from the N900. The descriptions and the tags, they'll also appear uploaded with that video. Thanks for watching, that was uploading photos and videos to Twitter and YouTube directly from the N900's gallery and camera application.